Hi everyone, this is Elvin from Plants of the Northern Palace. Today I want to share with you my experience with two different types of uh, semi-succulent peperomias. The first is Peperomia optocifolia and the second one is Peperomia polybotria. So I've started my Peperomia journey about three months ago with Peperomia optocifolia. At the point of time, I didn't really understand what semi-succulent is so I was a little heavy-handed when it comes to watering and uh, it has led to the rotting of the stem and uh, the rotting of the root but what's interesting is that the, well it, it experienced rotting everywhere beneath the soil but the the, the leaf itself was rubbery and uh, solid so I wouldn't have suspected that that you know it, it is dying and eventually the plant died and I have no choice but to chop them into pieces and reroot them in, in water. So it's not just the stem cuttings but I also did uh, leaf as well. Uh, the roots are growing but uh, I'm not sure what to do with it either. And one of the stem has extensive roots and I've decided to pot it in soil. And I've not watered it since I potted it about three days ago and I'll see how it goes. So after my dreadful experience with optocifolia, I thought I might be uh, a little more capable in handling similar peperomia plant. And that was when I decided to get a second plant, peperomia polybotria. I was so careful that I did not even water it when I brought it home. It was only until three weeks later I decided to give it a drink. And guess what? The stem rot again and then the root rot again. It's just unbelievable. So my poor polybotria suffers the same fate as my uh, optocifolia. Well, I, I don't know how it goes, but um, I'm having high hopes that it will root and just to have a second chance to play with it again. And if you ask me whether I have confidence to buy similar plants like that, uh, to be frank, I don't. But uh, let's see how this rescue process continues. And uh, if it works well, then perhaps that will give me uh, confidence to try other plants, other similar plants, but uh, as of now, I, I really don't and uh, it's really upsetting that I've killed two plants even though I, I, I felt I was very cautious with them. Thank you very much for dropping by and listening to my experience. If you have any care tips for this two peperomias, please leave a comment down below and I'll definitely check it out. Alright, have a fantastic day. See you.